Well, hello, and welcome back here to Layers of Fear. We are in this room with this strange, strange painting. It looks like, it just looks like somebody's bled on the canvas. And it's a dark and stormy night, and all was quiet around the campfire, as the captain said. It was a dark and no, let's not do that one. Um, I've changed the lighting since the last game. Uh, it's ironically less dark and gloomy because there were areas it was impossible to see. So now we know we have to get it right this time. So we should get back out there. There was a number of doors and drawers and that that we couldn't open. So let's get in there and see what they look like, shall we? So, ooh. Oh. All right. We can't get back. Let's move on. Is there anything of interest down here? No, just a corridor by the looks of it. And that room's changed as well. like nothing we see is going to remain the same reconnect with your partner rebuild your relationship rediscover the joy of marriage don't worry you're not alone perfect relationships may look great on the silver screen but the rest of us mortals have to face the simple truth nobody's perfect and you know what that's fine in fact, many loving couples struggle with day-to-day -day life in a relationship. It doesn't make them any less special. It just takes some work, and we're here to help. Our consultants, all trained experts in their field, will help you identify the source of your troubles and deal with it at your own pace. Whether it's simple miscommunication, money problems, or conflicting personalities, where there's a problem, there's always a solution. And remember... It's never too late. I think it's still a little bit too dark in here. We'll be back in a second. Here we are again. Okay, so yeah, we just looked at that. And is there anything in there? Nope. Okay. So yeah, it looks a little bit lighter in here. We can see in the corners. Still gloomy, still grim, still downright horrible, if you ask me. So hmm. just ah, out of reach. Okay. And of course I find the light switch at the end. Right. 
I'm going to have to learn to look for those, I think. Okay, we're not going back that way. Alright, anything in here? Oh, yep. Yeah. What's that? And that disappeared. So, I wonder what that was. Going in circles. Door closed, light switches. Let's remember to look for light switches. No light switches. Anything in there? No. What do we have on this desk? A wallet, a pipe. Nothing appears. Ooh, what's this? Combination. So we have here. Looks like there was a painting on the wall there once, but there isn't any more. A couple of busts. Can't see who they're made out to. Some more paintings. Okay, five, four, eight. Four, five, five, four, eight. There we go. The past holds back. Look closer. The thought alone that the most beautiful piece of art doesn't have my name on it is killing me. So, will you marry me? Hmm? Engagement ring. And all of a sudden a door. Anything in here? I can't open those. No, it doesn't appear so. Right. Let's move on. Alright. Chair rocking by itself. Why not? Hit boxes for these drawers are sometimes a little bit tight. You've been snooping around my workshop again. For the last time, you're not allowed in the room, even if the door happens to be open. I forbid it! This is your last warning. Next time, you'll have to look for a new job. Okay. Is this to paint the chair that he worked in? Doesn't seem right to the paint on a rocking chair. Okay. On we go. Okay, that looks a little bit weird. Let's go and have a look over there. Will that open? That won't open. These will. Let's have a quick look in here. I honestly think that the hitboxes for these drawers could be a bit better. But, never mind. In here. Nothing of any interest. Right. Ooh. Okay. Stuck in the dark. 
Uh, it's probably going to be even darker on YouTube, unfortunately, but I don't think there's anything I can do about this. Let's have a look over here at the light. What's that? Dust! Night! Even in my lungs! Grotesque vermin dirt! There's always more! Let's have another look. Huh. Okay. Right. Let's get out of here, shall we? As much as I'm enjoying this, I think that the walk, the walking the head bob is going to make me very nauseous fairly soon. There we go. Now oh, we're back here. And that painting's changed. Just check to make sure that there's nothing new in here. Nothing new back there. No, it's only spinning one direction. Odd. Okay, let's move on. And surprise, surprise. The room has changed. Ooh. Ooh. Paint deep lies. Now a tiny bit to the left. Yes, just like that. Hold that pose. I want to get all those lovely curves just right. <laughs> okay, lovely knees. Hmm. Right. Oh, that didn't disappear. I was expecting that one to disappear. Okay. Oh, right, that's changed. Okay. Something about that picture. Rats! Rats! That's a rat in that picture. Is that what was squeaking? Okay. Ha. Huh. He slipped out of the painting there. Hmm. Right. There's a chest under there. We can't open it though. Alright. Back the way we headed into a completely different room then. Alright. No, nothing. What's that? Oh, that's a fire hazard. Hey, in regards to your previous letter, I'm sure it's nothing to be concerned about. Women tend to get weird after having a baby, hormone imbalances and the like. When I, when we had our first, I remember Valerie got the blues real bad. I would ask her what she wanted for lunch and she just burst into tears. Just be there for her and I'm sure it's going to be fine. Now, I know I promised not to rush you and by all means enjoy your well-deserved time off, but just to let you know, 
I'm getting phone calls up the yin yang, commissions left and right. You're a hot ticket, my friend. Maybe we should strike while the iron, strike the iron while it's hot. But of course, the family comes first. Your friend and agent, Thomas Caldwell. Hmm, a man who's doing very well. A little bit of marital disharmony, though. Nothing of interest in here, by the looks of it, though. Okay. Sounds like a woman crying in there, but I can't get in. Hello. It's about time for us to talk, don't you think? I mean, I've seen you in my house so many times, and yet I could never find the courage to face you directly. Not until now. Hmm, I wonder who she was talking to. This way. Nope. This way. Nope. Not going back out there. Paprika. This is a man who likes his paprika. Broken glass, lots and lots of apples. Hmm. Making a good meal there. Is that broken glass? Yes, I think it is. And into the kitchen. Does this mean that things are going to start getting normal again? Um, any notes or anything? First, I looked for a canvas. Not just any canvas. I had to find a knife. Not one of those bread ones. It needed to be as sharp as a razor. So I used a razor, in fact, and then carefully flayed the skin. Booze helped keep my hand steady. Okay. Now the question is, what or whose skin? Let's see if we can get back out through here. Ah. Back here, hey. Oh, there's the picture of the piano. Guessing that was probably his wife. And, yep, yeah, one of the drawings. Apples, lots and lots of apples. Hate, even now, lost. You deserve it. Finish it. Deep breaths. Remember, you're a professional. It's just the first few strokes, then you're over the hump. 
What's so hard about it? Oh dear. Oh, shapeless dreams. Well, let's do this. Peyton changes a little bit more form, perhaps. And there's the skin. The canvas. And next time, we'll go through that door again and see where it takes us. But until then, I've been Simon Parsons. This has been Layers of Fear. Thank you. And good night. Well, hello. Damien here. Did you like this? Please leave a like. If you didn't, leave a dislike. And don't forget to leave a comment. Mm -hmm.